Good news. Keep an eye on this video. Hi, welcome back. So, it is good news. Keep an eye on this video. Did you see what I did there? No, oh, never mind. Just a minute. Oh, it's too early in the morning, but I've got a lot to do today. Anyway, so yeah, it's good news. I saw my eye surgeon yesterday. The guy that I've been seeing since, oh, 2009 or 10, I think. Um, I saw him in September last year. And he told me that you've got some small changes at the back of the eye. Um, some tiny bleeds, but nothing to be concerned about. So, of course, if somebody tells you you've got tiny bleeds in the back of the eye and you've had as many eye complications as I've had, telling you it's nothing to be concerned about means that you're going to be concerned anyway. So I was. Um, he indicated that those tiny bleeds were down to my much better A1C. Um, I started 2017 with an A1C of 8.9 and ended 2017 with an A1C of 6.8. And that's a significant fall, 6.8%. And that's a, uh, that's a significant fall in numbers. Now, a complication of that, good that it is, means that in diabetes, diabetics of a certain age, me, you can get these tiny little bleeds in the eye. Um, usually they clear themselves up if you're managing your diabetes well and you're looking after your blood glucose, they usually go away. That's what I was led to believe. So yesterday I went back to see the eye doc and he told me that they'd completely gone. He had a good look in the eye, nothing there, no sign of anything. In fact, he said it's the best condition my eye has been in, in seven years. And it was seven years ago give or take, when he started poking and sticking things in there. <laughs> so I'm absolutely delighted about this news. That means um, I can get on with life as normal without concern that something's going to happen to my vision in the near future. Um, I'm going back in six months, so summertime this year, we'll go back and take another look. In between that time, I will have another A1C to see where things are. I don't imagine I'll be 6.8. I'm hoping to be seven or low sevens. But you know, if some if it falls into the sixes again, amazing. I didn't imagine 6.8 last time either, but it still happened, so good stuff. What else is happening? Well, um, the tattoo from the net, so what can you see? Yeah. It's okay. It's getting better. Um, it was um, itchy, itchy as itchy on Monday. Um, I've been putting the um, lotion on there as advised by my tattoo artist, and it seems to be almost there now. It kind of healed up and isn't too itchy anymore. So I'm guessing in a few days. <laughs> Maybe in the coming week or so, that should be fine, just as it is. 
and then we might go and have a look and get another one. Maybe. Yeah, we'll go and have a look and get another one, I think. I'm getting a bit addicted to tattoos. I've been talking to so many people on Twitter and Insta and Facebook. And many of you have sent me some um, fascinating pictures of your tattoos. Thanks for that. And, <laughs> and it's kind of inspired me and makes me want to get more. So stay tuned and you might see some more. So that's it for today. It's short and sweet. Um, just like my coffee. But I'll be back soon with a new update. And uh, if you want to watch some more videos, you can click on something over here. And up this side, you can sub to the channel. And thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye for now.